morning. It's Boxing Day. Hope you all had a good Christmas. We've just parked up at Walnut Scar Road near Coniston. Meet Tracy. Merry Christmas. And Billy, the rock star. Where we've just left the car park. We're going to head up through the Boulder Valley in the direction of Leavers Water and then on to Black Sails and then eventually Weatherland. It's an absolute beautiful morning. The forecasts for a good day and then later this evening I think there's heavy snow coming in to the lakes turning to rain and gales tomorrow and I don't think it's too great for the rest of the week so we're going to make the best of this one no wind so hopefully we'll get the drone up that little hill over there just across the way from the footpath is called the Bell it's a classified hill I'm not sure where, I think it's probably a Singe it's not a Wainwright or a Burkitt I've been up that one but Tracy hasn't so we might nip up there on the way back We've got an old quarry building here as we start heading into the Boulder Valley there's the old shaft there I would imagine and into the Boulder Valley we go you can actually climb up the back side of this big boulder in front of us I'm not going to do it today I've done it in the past Cross the beck at the big boulder and head up the pitched path. The ridge to the right of Leavers Water is Black Sails. That's the one we're going to go up and then we're going to come back down the other side. And there's Leavers Water. I've completely forgotten the name of this big cave, cleft in the rocks, just at the bottom of Leaver's Water. I'll put some text in later and let you know what it's called. It's quite impressive. There's a lovely bit of stonework here as we cross the dam at Leaver's Water.
across the dam at Leaver's Water and then take the path leading right to the bottom of the ridge here and then we're going to take a left and head up the ridge the two paths join here and we'll take that left just here Tracy took a shortcut <laughs> There is no path on the OS map up the ridge of Black Sails unless it's been updated but there's a clear path on the ground it zigzags its way through the boulders The weather that was supposed to come in later tonight and tomorrow looks like it could have arrived early we're heading up into the clog it might clear it might just be a snow shower looks like it could be snowing heavy on the high fells this ridge up black sails is a fantastic route up onto Wetherlam like I said before the fact that it doesn't have a footpath on the map would probably put people off but as you can see there's a clear path runs right through the middle of the ridge The summit of Black Sails, 745 metres. It's a Burkitt, a Hewitt, and a Nuttall. And there's the summit cairn. From the summit of Black Sails, we're going to head over to Wetherlam if we can find it I'm almost certain a few people must have got caught out in this weather today it certainly ain't the blue skies that were forecast there's Wetherlam ahead of us it's trying its hardest to clear we might get lucky To the left of us, just peeking through the clag, we've got the Crinkles. This is Wetside Edge, where we were the other week when we went on to Great Cars. Langdale's is still in the mist over there. And I think the fells further north are clear. all cleared there now, Pike of Blisco straight in front of us we're almost at the summit of Wetherlam now some beautiful atmospherics going on now
Weatherland Summit 763 meters it's a Wainwright a Burkitt a Hewitt a Nuttall and a Hump a Hump and look who's beat us up how did you get a piece of quick? He's super fast. Yeah. There's the summit can. Like a gazelle. And there's Tracy the gazelle. <laughs> we'll do you the 360. So from the summit of Weatherlam, we're going to head down a traverse path to Keldgill Head where we'll turn at the Swirl Hawes and head back down to Leavers Water. Back in the direction of Black Sails, you can see it now, that's it just ahead of us. You'll find the path just to the right below Black Sails, just down there. That's where we're going to head and the path runs down off the right hand side and traverses this shoulder. Straight ahead of us we've got Swirl House with the prison band coming down from it. To the right of Swirl House we've got Great Cars. To the left we've got Brimfell. And right down here below us we've got the Swirl Hose where we're going to take a left and drop back down into Leavers Water. So at this gigantic or Cairn, we're going to take a left, aren't we Billy? No, maybe not, come on! <laughs> and head back down into Leavers Water. I'll take a loud moment on this easy going path. I'd like to thank 
each and every one of you for getting me to a thousand subscribers on YouTube absolutely delighted about that thank you for all the comments and the lovely feedback I get and I hope you continue to enjoy my channel and watch my videos because there's plenty more to come There's a couple of beautifully constructed cairns on the way back down to Lever's Water. This one in particular, look at that. <laughs> How cool is that? As I nearly fall down into the tarn. And another nice one here, perched on this slab of rock. Look at that, very well made, beautiful. Path takes us all the way back to the dam we crossed earlier this morning runs along the left hand side of Lever's water close to the water's edge So we're back where we started at Lever's Water. We're going to plod back through the Boulder Valley and then back down to Walnut Scar. So I'm going to wrap my video up here. I'd like to say thank you for watching. If you like my content, please think about giving me a subscribe. If you like Tracy's content, give her a subscribe too. <laughs> thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. All the best for New Year. Almost three. There he is. The rock star. <laughs>